my life with regards to Notre Dame, it's been a gift. Um, it's a gift that keeps on giving. And, you know, I look at the foundation my parents gave me. And then when you build a house, you have a foundation. And then there's a main beam that goes in that house. And then from there on, you add on to that house. And that's what Notre Dame High School uh, was to me and is to me 35 years later. Um, it was a privilege to go here. And, um, you know, if you look at the core values, character of confidence, you know, compassion. And I, I like to use the word commitment too, because, you know, Notre Dame taught you that commitment to yourself is one of the most important things. So it was when you're committed to yourself, you can come out and commit to everything else in your, in your life. I have a story that, um, that it comes into my life at every single time. And um, it's a little long, so I'll try and shorten it. But so my freshman year, um, I got chosen after freshman football to go and play and train with the varsity up into the Green Bowl. And it was a handful of us that you know, got chosen as freshmen. So we got the extra week and a half to practice with the varsity and you know, with Coach Bond because I was a, a down lineman. And so we go to the Green Bowl and there's like 10,000 people there. I'm 14 years old and I'm training with all the, you know, the warming up with all the guys. And he brings us in right before the game and he starts talking about how the cream always rises to the, to the top. The cream always rises to the top. And just this intensity, and I'm looking at these 10,000 people, I'm looking at the seniors, guys like uh, Todd Presnick and Jack Marr, and I can see the tears going down their eyes, Jeff Charles, and just his passion that he was speaking to them about how the cream always rises to the top, playing football for Notre Dame and putting on that gold helmet and that green jersey. Come senior year, same speech by Coach Bond, but the biggest difference was I was crying with him. My message to the Notre Dame students that are here today and then, you know, who are considering coming to Notre Dame and the ones that, you know, in the future would be trust the process. You know, you're going to be, you're going to be 14 years old and you're going to be like, oh, I'm going to go to this Catholic school and this Brothers of Holy Cross and there's, there's no girls. But I will tell you, these four years here at Notre Dame High School will shape your life. It's a true brotherhood. My teammates, my classmates are my best friends then and they still are today 35 years later and i wouldn't trade in for anything so again to do the future green knights just trust the process trust what your parents are saying to you and i guarantee you you will walk out here as a better person and you'll look back 20 years 30 years later saying what a great choice um, and what a great impact Notre Dame high school had in my life being chosen as, as a knight of honor is a true humbling experience to me and I truly go in representing my entire class, the class of 84. There's obviously a lot of people I would like to like, acknowledge as, as part of this um, receiving the Knights of Honor Award. And the first two most important people are obviously my parents who are no longer with us, but are with us in heart with my brothers, John, who's class of 87, my brother Timmy, who's class of 2000, sisters Ellen and Ann, who are St. Mary's girls, um, couldn't have two better sisters in, um, in, my, in my life. More importantly, I had Mother 1A, and that was my aunt, Sister Ann Kilbride. See all my coaches here at Notre Dame, Coach Marcucci, Coach Bond, Coach Gersha, Coach Marazzi, Coach Tarleglio. These um, people had real impact on my life, not just as, as a player, but as a man throughout, throughout my life. Those core values of Notre Dame High School, of um, you know, character, compassion, confidence, and, and commitment, my wife, Kathy, exhibits all those. So um, I'm very grateful to have her in my life. The three most important things in our lives are three daughters, Mae, Flynn, and Sloan. Um, you know, they unfortunately can't go to Notre Dame High School, but we try and instill those, those core values of Notre Dame in their lives every single day. I'm forever grateful to uh, Notre Dame High School, and I'm forever proud to be a Green Knight.